My name is Juliet Eve and I'm a face painter. I've been painting about 20 years or so. Uh, so I'm here at Paradise Wildlife Park today to show you how to paint some popular faces. Right, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to face paint a lion. We start with the base. I've got all three colours on the one sponge. Keep your head there, that's fine. So I'll start with the centre. With boys, they're often quite sensitive on their face, so it's a good idea not to go straight for the eyes, but I sort of work across the nose, sweep under the eyes, and if you can, get as much paint on the face, you know, in as short a time as possible. Just around those eyes. And I sometimes, you can sort of stroke it in with the sponge. Just adds again a bit of cat looking streaks. Can look a bit stripy or a bit lionish. Right, now I'm going to add the white around the muzzle. So around the muzzle and down onto the chin. Lions tend to have white chins as well, white hairy chins. Head up and close your eyes very gently and over the eye. Start with the nose, do a brown nose. over the nostrils and round to the front. Not over the whole thing, just around the front. And then down into the centre line to make the split lip. So a very thin line down the centre and then turn it into an A quite near the lip. And then what I do with lines, I don't make the top lip brown. What I tend to do is to make the mouth sign of droopy, which is what lions have. I take it, I put a droopy line there and there. And then I go up with the muzzle. And just finish off with a light flick. And then to make the whisker spots, okay, just very lightly tapping the brush, the tip of it, just around like that lightly tipping. I'll um, just the middle of the lip. I think it kind of makes the whole mouth look droopy which works on, on the lion. What I'm going to do is a little tip I recommend if you are doing eyes on children so that they can open their eyes quite soon. I get a tissue and just lay it across the eye, a dry tissue, lift off do the other side. Whoops, sorry. There we are, now you can open your eyes. So the stripes I've got underneath are a bit cat-like. And then I'm going to put some curls as well. Just twiddle a brush around, any old wear really, make a curly. And then on the side as well, we'll put some curly mane here. When you're doing whiskers, try and plant them actually in the whisker spots. So on lines, they're quite nice and long and droopy quite often. And do a few different angles, makes it for a bit more realism as well. There we are. So that's how to do lion makeup. As you can see, I've done a, a, a sort of lighter base, yellow base, mixed with some oranges and some light brown. Then I've added brown on the nose, brown on the eyes, uh, around the muzzle. I've done these droopy bits, that's quite important to make it look more liony. Um, and a curly mane. 